folks, welcome back to the Academy Project. As always, it is Mark Maxwell on the call. We've got a fun one coming up for you here today. It's the mysterious Sigma from Solar City takes on Andrew Acosta. No bell, so the ref improvising. Love to see that level of creativity, and that's what freelance is all about here. And two men that are very creative in their own right, Sigma, very mysterious, odd man. Not much known about him, but Andrew Acosta, a very interesting character in his own right. This man, only five foot four, 170 pounds, but he is tougher than a $2 steak, folks. And something that's very interesting about him, too, is he started his wrestling career later on. He is looking to make up for lost time. He didn't start until 25, and uh, he, he's been training for 10 months. And we see him here today. He wants to make an impression. He wants to do it quick. Neither man really gaining a firm advantage early on. We have the collar and elbow tied, and Sigma so slick into that headlock. Costa shoves him off the ropes, but he's just sent flying down to the mat from that powerful shoulder tackle from Sigma. Tries to trip up Sigma, can't do it. Acosta over with the leapfrog. Huge hip toss. Don't let the lack of size fool you. 175 5'4", he's got a lot of power behind him. And you see with that arm drag, too, putting his whole body into everything that he does. Speaking of his whole body, too, he uses that A-double stomp as his finisher. Uses his whole body weight for that as he gets the Irish whip and another arm drag. I love just the torque across his entire body as he drags Acosta down with that every single time. Acosta trying to keep him down, but Sigma using those long legs, legs to get up to his feet. The shoulder just being wrung out here, though. Finally gets the rope. And now just looking at these two guys, from a visual perspective, you would not expect the larger man to be the one working his way up from a hold like that, but there he is. Nevertheless, though, just did some serious, serious damage to that arm. With that escape, turning defense into offense, and now a savage, savage kick to that arm. Sigma talking a big game, talking smack, but Acosta, he's used to being the underdog. You know, when you start training to become a pro wrestler at 25, people don't, don't tell you, oh yeah, that's a great idea, especially when you're 5'4". He's used to people telling him no. He's used to having to overcome this adversity. And that's why the Freelance Faithful are rallying behind him as his arm is just getting completely wrenched around that top rope. Sigma both methodical and ruthless in his approach. Nothing fancy about that, just a club to the back. Costa with that quick shot to the kidney, I like that. Little range of motion, doesn't have to use too much of his arm, but still super, super effective. That'll cripple you. You get dead in your tracks, but Sigma's still catching that back elbow. Cover, hook of the leg, deep hook, one, two, only two. Sigma, say what you will about him, but still very fundamentally sound in his approach. Love that just simple elbow, not overthinking it, hooking the leg deep. Now a firm, firm kick to the chest. That'll take the wind right out of you. Went too high on that one. Schoolboy, one, two. Oh, only two for Acosta there. And Sigma looks furious that that wasn't the end of it. And sends him to the mat with an arm ringer. Now got the arm wrapped up. This is not going to be pretty twisting it. And then snapping that shoulder down with the leverage, using his foot to get underneath the arm. The ref might want to consider putting this stop to this one. Because if Acosta, if he can't use his arms, it's going to be harder and harder for him to intelligently defend himself as this match goes on. Sigma, huge leap out of that handspring. And again, using that axe style kick to the back of the arm this time. Cover one, two, and Acosta is still fighting. You gotta wonder though if it may be better to just stay down and live to fight another day. 
And those forearms, he's just going nuts on him. Oh no, roaring elbow cut him right on the temple. Acosta's got him right where he wants him, but his arms are just shot. Oh, telegraphed it too much. Sent shoulder first into the top turnbuckle. This is getting difficult to watch at this stage. And top for this like No, 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 prawn hold. One, two, and three. That's three. Acosta pulled it out. Huge upset win, and Andrew Acosta overcoming adversity to get the dub.